Yo, what's going on YouTube? Just Jake here and welcome back to my channel for another GTA Online video. And in today's video, we're going to be doing a movie car build on Bumblebee from the Transformers. Now, this movie car build is going to be on the 2006 Camaro concept version. Uh, they do also have an older version, as a lot of people should know. Uh, but that one was based on a 1977 Camaro concept. Uh, but, you know, I'm opting to do the 2006 version because then I can use the Bravado Gauntlet inside of GTA to create this build. So if any of you guys do want to follow me on this build, all you have to do is go to Southern San Andreas, go and purchase a Bravado Gauntlet for 32 grand. Meet me back in Ella Customs and I'll show you how to do the rest. So you go my dudes, as you pull into Ella Customs you'll see the Bravado Gauntlet is rightly so in the muscle category. And we're going to start this build as always with 100% body armor, then we're going to go to the brakes, we're going to get the race brakes and for the engine we're going to get a level 4 engine upgrade. Then we're going to move to the lights, you want to go into headlights and purchase the Xeon headlights. Then we're going to go into the respray, once you're in here you want to go into primary colour and into classic. Because we do have two, two different colours on this car, obviously we've got the racing stripe on the front and if we have a metallic, then it's going to make a weird shine on that racing stripe and it doesn't look you know completely right so we're going to stay classic for this and then once you are in classic you are going to go and purchase bright orange and then we're going to move on to the secondary color at the moment mine is black which i'm going to double check which it is yeah it's 100 percent black and that's the color you need so we're going to stay black for the secondary color so next we're going to move to the suspension i'm going to get the sports suspension then we've got the transmission i'm going to get a race transmission and a turbo tuning now for the wheels guys, we're going to go into wheel type and into sport. Uh, I, th I think we're going to go chrome with this. I mean, obviously you can go stock if you'd like, if you're limited on cash because, you know, uh, they're, they're a lot cheaper than the chrome rims, to be honest. So you can go chrome or you can go stock on this. It's personal preference, you know, money and all that sort of stuff. So once you've chose the category that you want to go into, whether it be stock or chrome, you then want to go and purchase these rims called Duper 7. Like I said, 80 grand's a lot of fucking money for some rims, man. So if you haven't got the cash, go and grab the Duper 7 in the stock rims, which will be alloy. And whilst we're here, guys, we are going to go into the tyres and purchase the bulletproof tyres. And to finish off the build, as always, we're going to go into the windows and purchase the light smoke window tint. So you go, my bros. There is my variation of Bumblebee from the Transformers, a.k.a. the 2006 Chevy Camaro concept. And you know what? I think this build is very simple, but looks very effective. Uh, this gauntlet is so much like the Camaro it's, it's unreal you know uh, obviously there are some quite slight but obvious changes that Rockstar have made to the Bravado gauntlet so it doesn't look identical to, to a Camaro um, I'm a little bit unsure about the racing stripe I mean obviously it looks cool because we can make this car you know orange and black like Bumblebee is but I would prefer not to have a, the whole length of the car and just have it on the hood with the two racing stripes instead of the one. Um, obviously, we've got the dual headlights, which Bumblebee does not have, but they are circular, so that's something. So, um, overall, I think it's a really good build, but there is obviously subtle, but like I said, obvious changes that Rockstar have made to this car to make it not look so much like a, um, a Camaro. So this is one of the cards which I think has been underappreciated in GTA. I really, really like the Bravado Gauntlet. And um, Rockstar have kind of forgotten about all their older cards that they first released into the game. So I'd like to see like a, a car like the Bravado Gauntlet go into, be able to go into Benny's, you know, so we can get some pretty cool upgrades for it. Maybe change the dual headlights to singular headlights you know maybe change that massive fucking one racing stripe going the length of the car into just you know a, a, a double racing stripe just on the hood so things like that you know that we maybe we could change in Benny's but I can't see it happening unless we get another big Benny's update uh, which I, I can't see just yet uh, we'll have to wait a little bit longer for that but like I said I think Rockstar needs to appreciate the cars that are already in the game and give us different options for them, i.e. Benny's, you know, and all that sort of stuff, or the mobile operations centre, whatever, just to give us a little bit more options for the vehicles that we've already got, because the, the cars we've got, man, are fucking sweet, you know, like the Gauntlet, I love the Gauntlet, I love the Dominator in the game, you know, all these different types of vehicles that we've had since day one, uh, I think they're just going a little bit underappreciated, but going off track now, <laughs> I'm going off topic just slightly, but yeah, like I was saying, this is going to be the end of the video now anyway, uh, my build on Bumblebee, aka the 2006 Camaro, 
I think it looks pretty good. You know, it works well. The rims are fucking spot on, man. They look identical. The rear is fucking sweet. The side is sweet. The front is a little bit, you know, a little bit to, to be desired. It's, it's not perfect, but it's, it's very, very close. And like I said, also the livery isn't perfect but it's close enough for me but yeah like i said end of the video hope you guys did enjoy if you did enjoy please give me a two sweet and until next time guys i'm out adios